Um, OnlyFans? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do OnlyFans. No, I'm not doing OnlyFans, motherfucker. No, I'm hey man, we can we can all dream. <laughs> Maybe one day, if I get my body in in shape, I'll probably you know do OnlyFans. Nice. You know, I was thinking about that. If I got like my body, I was thinking, but maybe I'm too old now. You know what I'm saying? But I was thinking like, yeah, never too old. You're never too old. I know. Look at freaking um, what's his face? It's very Stallone. He's he's Jack, but of course that's probably steroids though. Oh, you know, I don't know why he chose like the the, the oldest oldest guy. <laughs> huh? He's like chose the like the oldest oldest. I know, guy. huh? <laughs> I, I I ain't nowhere near his age, but um, what I was saying, um, uh, yeah, I was thinking about I was, I'm really serious thinking about doing this brokathon. Um, don't you have to be there for like hours though? Yeah, but I was thinking about I could do it on my phone. Oh, I see. I can just stream stream on my phone all day. While I'm driving and streaming on my phone all night when I'm at home. Hmm. I don't know. I was thinking about it. I, I think it might be a good, a good, you know, because you know, going off the hill of the whole cast and that thing. I think it'd be a good marketing thing for my YouTube channel. I don't know. But I was, I, I'm not gonna do no whole thirty days. Fuck that. I was thinking. Right, about, right. I was thinking. I was thinking you about should, doing. You should start off slow, like a twenty-four hour stream. Yeah. Yeah. I was thinking about either that or maybe like maybe two days or something like that. Maybe forty-eight hours. Maybe twenty-four hours. About twelve hours. Let's start with twelve hours. Twelve hours? I, yeah. I've done ten already, though. Uh, okay. I was thinking maybe. I was thinking maybe. Maybe. May, I don't know. Maybe. I was gonna say maybe ten days. Oof. That's a long time That's to be on stream, huh? Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm not gonna be entertaining these motherfuckers for a whole fucking ten days. Fuck that. I ain't got the kind of budget Carson they got. You have Chris Brown <laughs> stop by my crib and shit like that. <laughs> right, but I'm saying like, like, what are you doing in the streams? I mean, maybe like driving around, maybe it might be like entertaining, but like after that, it's, it's just just you moving around or sitting down, you know? Yeah, me. It'll be me driving in the car, and then you know, when I don't have nobody in the car, I'd be me just, I guess, fucking around in my car, and then when I get home, okay, okay. huh? Because you, you need an idea. Yeah. The reason why people click on that link of the stream, I think, how many hours, how many hours of Uber driving can I do in one sitting? That's a good stream. Because people would check back in, like, oh, this guy has been at it for like eight hours. That's a, that could be a good test run, huh? To see yeah, I yeah, and also like you know, people will click on that link because you, you're. You're posing a question like, "Oh, how long can can this guy actually drive for?" You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. That's a good idea. Yeah, I can start. I can start with that. You know. Right, and you still have that entertainment factor, and people are like, because you know, they'll pop in every like two minutes, and they pop out. Yeah, they're not gonna watch me. Yeah, just drive. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. But you know, people will always check in. They're like, "Oh, is he still driving?" My my God, dude. <laughs> See, that's cool, you know. Yeah, yeah, I could do that tonight. As opposed, to like, oh, is Charles in his couch? <laughs> Charles taking a shower. I'm like, what? What? Because I already know you. That's what you're gonna do. <laughs> I mean, I would pop in and talk about you know uh, tidbits and, and you know life lessons and stuff like that. People can get gems from me. Right, right, but you don't have like a kind of a, kind of a moving something emotionally moving and something for the the viewers to be emotionally attached. Be like, Jesus Christ, this guy is still driving. Good for him, you know. Right, like right. Like emotionally, emotionally invested in your shit. Mm, like how long? Yeah. Uh, okay, okay, okay. So it's almost like a challenge. It has to be some some type yeah, of. Yeah, you're challenge. doing a challenge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah, like Mr. Beast would do. He would do. Um, can I saw this table with a plastic plastic knife? So you would have to go after. <laughs> you would have to like listen. You might have to sleep in your car. <laughs> <laughs> the challenge is like if I stop the car, but if I do stop the car, I can't get out of the car. 
right? Yeah. I, I can't get out of the car. I have to piss inside the car. The only reason I can get out is only to poop. <laughs> Those are the rules. I can't pee in the car. This car too small. I had to pee in a ball in a tube. Yeah, you figure that out. It's just, you know, being one of those uh, gallon things. I have to get out of the car and piss around. Come on, that's the big of a challenge, dude. <laughs> Give him a challenge right there. <laughs> you can't get out of the car. What about the shower? Nope. No shower. This is the challenge. <laughs> you bring some wipes. Wipe your house down, dude. This is a good video now. I'm actually recording it. That's what I was going to let you know. Yeah, this is a really good video now. <laughs> oh, man. The Uber driver challenge. How many hours can I drive? There. Boom. That's the link. The Uber drive challenge. How many hours can I drive? Yep. Boom. Simple. Effective. Wow. <laughs> The, the screenshot is you naked with no wipes in your car. <laughs> you said me in the car. This <laughs> is like a, a passenger in the back. You know? Like, what? <laughs> like, sorry, man. I gotta take a quick shower. Like, what? Oh, hold on, <laughs> it's cool. I'm not gonna get naked. I just don't need my wipes. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! And you, you could cut up like a bunch of stuff from that stream because it's hysterical. <laughs> oh man! Oh man! Yeah, I, was, I think you know I could start with that the the Uber drive chat. I like that idea. That way, I, that, yeah, way not, yeah. I, that, that way I'm not just sitting you, in my and apartment. you're still making money at the same time you're doing it. Doing it, yeah, huh? Yeah, well, that's a good idea. I think I may start with the Uber Drive Challenge. How many hours can I drive? <laughs> and you have to tell your passenger, like, listen, hey, uh, I'm on hour 15. And you're like, excuse me? <laughs> I'm on the challenge here. I've been driving for 15 hours. I'm just letting you know. Are uh, you ready? I'm like, what? <laughs> <laughs> hey, people, you know what? I have been on live while I had people in the car. I mean, of course I don't show them, but they they always ask me like, "Oh, so are you are you live? Or what are you live on?" And I'd be like, oh, so, "Sometimes I'd be like, oh, I'm just streaming to my to my to my channel, you know, something." And then they, they're like, "Oh, cool." But I think if I did the Uber Drive Challenge, that probably be that'll be like a conversation piece. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's almost hysterical. Like the first hour, people are cool, you know. Yeah. And like hour eighteen. People are like concerned, you know, because you have to keep telling them, like, "Hey, I'm just letting you know, I've been been driving for 20 hours." <laughs> like, what? <laughs> I hope we all have to go far. <laughs> hey, you know what? I, I can also like post like my cash app and shit. Yeah, yeah, you can do that too. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I, I doubt anybody donates, but still, it'd be it'd be dope just to you know just throw it out there. Yeah. Boom. How, how many how many hours can I drive Uber? Yeah, the the Uber challenge. How many hours you could drive in Uber without getting out of the car? I gotta pee, Ryan. No, dude. This is the rules. These are the rules. I can't even see how I can even piss comfortably without getting out of the car in this small ass car I got. Come on, figure it out. Right, <laughs> those gallon uh, water jugs. You know. Put your I'll, dick in the hole like a I'll, grown man. <laughs> Motherfuckers used to do that shit when they was doing Britney back in the day. Yeah, I know. I, I did it. All right? I had a gallon of piss. <laughs> Me and Angelo, a gallon of piss. Each, just like, gallons of piss. Like, hand, me, hand, me, hand, me the, hand me the Gatorade bottle. I can't I, I take a piss. <laughs> Oh shit! I don't know. Maybe I should. Maybe I start tomorrow. Hell yeah, dude! Yeah, I gotta get a good night's sleep. And you gotta bring a, a lot of uh, 
uppers like you know uh red bull um what are good uppers are they're legal speed um, speed that's not no you could take uh I, I get some speed. over the counter um those pills over the counter pills they're called uh i don't know what they're called but they're yeah but they're like Cl- clinical over-the-counter speed. I forgot what it's called. Can I go to the? Can I go to the, the performances and say, "Hey, you, you guys got any speed?" You can't say that. You could say like, <laughs> you're like, oh, caffeine pills. You can't. You take caffeine pills. Caffeine pills. Okay. Okay. Do they really make those? And then you could do reviews. Yeah, the, the, you could, it's a uh, it's over the counter. Mm. And then you could take those five-hour energy drinks. You could also do like a. Review and all all that stuff. Yeah, then I crash. You know, out. there's a yeah, there's a, a, a Powerade and Red Bull gum that's supposed to give you energy. I didn't know that. Yeah, you can review all that on your stream and then cut it up. Yeah, that's a good, that's, that's a good idea. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And you can pull up to every like Starbucks, Dunkin' Donuts getting like hey i need some caffeine and tell them the story like what kind of ca- caffeine do you need i'm on like an hour 24 hours of driving Dude, what do you have in there do you have crack, crack in there? <laughs> excuse me sir oh shit see that's cool yeah i was thinking about doing a uh i was thinking about doing a rap snack review too oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah. see there's like all the things you could do in the car right right see what i'm saying you know um you know you, you know these rappers got different uh, potato chips. The cool part about it is you can only get that shit like in the hood. Mm-hmm. I don't even think they even sell them at Seven Eleven. But of course you got like I think um, who has one? Little the baby has a rap snack. Little baby has a rap snack. I think Ti has one. So I can get like all their rap snacks and like review them. Who has the best rap snack? You know. Yeah. Okay. So I like that. The Uber ride challenge. How long can I do? How long can I do Uber? How long can you drive without getting out of the car? Yeah. You gotta set the rules immediately. And you gotta tell each passenger the rules. <laughs> when they get in the car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I'm, I'm on power twenty seven. Just letting yeah. you know, and I can't get out of the car. <laughs> Excuse me? Uh, I have to go to Santa Monica. Can you make it to Santa Monica? We'll fucking see. And you pop a Red Bull. <laughs> if I'm falling asleep, that's our ass. <laughs> oh, man. But you don't pop a Red Bull regularly. You you pop a hole in the bottom, and then you suck it from the bottom like a G. Like, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! You should also bring peppers, all kinds of hot shit to wait. Make you wake. What is that? Why bring peppers? To wake you up. Peppers wake you up. Yeah, you ever like like chili, like red hot chili? Yeah, yeah. I, I didn't know it was like I didn't know. It, well, I mean, it makes you it makes you your, your, your mouth hot. Yeah, but it also wakes your whole body up. I didn't know that. Hmm. I gotta start eating jalapenos in the morning when I feel groggy. Then I ain't know that. Yeah, yeah, it, it kicks or it starts you. Also, smelling salts—that's a good review. The smelling salts is over the <laughs> counter. This stream is I'm starting to be amazing now. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh. You should like also offer your your uh, passengers all the stuff. Like, listen, I have Red Bull, I have caffeine pills, I have smelling salts. Do you want any? <laughs> <laughs> I have wipes. What about Red Bull? <laughs> yeah. I pick up people from the airport. I'm trying to think, uh, what can I sell motherfuckers that I pick up from the airport? All, all money goes towards my live stream. Hey, did you like that video I put on the um, on the chat? On the uh, the thing? <laughs> This is very serious. That was the most serious video I've ever seen from you. <laughs> I was very passionate about that. The Biden video. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> it's the truth. 
Old ass man, the fuck we doing? Man, uh -huh. old as hell. Yeah. I got a lot of comments from that video too. The short. It was a short. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. I was I, I was thinking to myself, Ronnie gonna put this on his channel, man. They'll fucking they'll they'll start unsubscribing from Ryan's channel. They'll think Ryan. Oh, I don't really care. They're like, they'll think Ryan is joined the Black Panthers. <laughs> I mean, I still post politics, but I've been kind of switching it up. Oh, you oh, okay? Are you doing other stuff now? Yeah, I think it's time. Yeah, where do you want to go to now? I'm just gonna do whatever I feel like. You yeah, just throw up something and see what sticks. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's the YouTube way. Throw it up against the wall and see what sticks. You don't videotape brushing, videotape yourself brushing your teeth. Throw it up on YouTube. It's that or like go the other way, but the other way is like for dinosaurs. Like, like Rory just keeps like pushing me. Like, hey man, like why don't you just be become like a writing team and then we write something and then pushing out to festivals and writing meetings and I'm like, dude, that doesn't. That's like Hollywood ten is, years ago. Yeah, I was like, Hollywood is done, dog. Yeah, if you're famous and already have like a big network, people just come to you. Right, right, yeah. Do you think right. uh, Mr. Beast got a call from Amazon? Be like, oh. I've been seeing, <laughs> I, I've been seeing billboards of him all over LA. I was like, good for him. All from his bedroom. Mm hmm. Right. You you get yourself to that point, then you wait to them, you, you, then you let them come to you. Oh, do you think McDonald's was like, Got a call from Kaisen. I'm like, no, McDonald's called Kaisen called, immediately. Called, right, they called him. Right, you have to have the numbers. Nobody, you, you can't. Yeah, the the whole I'm a nobody, but I have these great ideas. Let me pitch them to you. That's dead. You're gonna be 50 years old to make sure before you make that happen. Right. I mean, unless you're extremely lucky, you sell one script, and then wow, that one script actually does well, and then you can do another script. I mean. Yeah. The, the chance of that is just, you know, astronomical. Yeah. I, yeah. The old way of career. I remember going to a studio and I saw, I was at Warner Brothers and I was doing temp stuff. And it, it just made me realize, like, damn. It was a dumpster. Like the stacks and stacks of scripts. Yeah. It was just all these scripts in the dumpster. I was helping. It's, oh, these are scripts y'all already done? I'm like, no, these scripts are scripts that people have sent to us that we haven't read. Like, are you serious? Like the old dumpster full. Like, right, and I'm, I'm pretty sure there's one pile, a small pile of they knew somebody from this fucking script. They're like the cousin of whatever. Or right. Mm -hmm. They're the friend of the studio, and like they gotta read it because of that. Right. Mm hmm. I was like, so it's, it's somebody's script in here that's probably thought, oh shit, I'm, gonna, I'm probably they're gonna love this script. This motherfucker's in the dumpster. <laughs> Yeah, like fucking Rory. It's just like, dude, let's get some ideas going. I'm like, no, dude. That shit's done. <laughs> I just saw, I just, I don't know, I just sitting, I'm just looking at that dumpster just full of scripts. I'm like, wow. Like, somebody probably thought they, I like, they probably got like an Oscar winning script. They probably never got read. Just, never got read. Just getting ready to go to the fucking landfill. Let's <laughs> spend hours on this script. Hours? How about years, dude? Yeah, on this strip, this motherfucker is finna be in the damn, in the damn wasteland. Never been read. Never got. A, probably got a letter from Warner Brothers. Thank you for your script, but unfortunately, blah 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 blah. Talking. Yeah, place. copy and paste it. Uh, thank you so much for your script. <laughs> Fucking written by an intern, signed by an intern oh, from the CEO from Warner Brothers, but it was just an intern. Yeah. Shit is going in the. I was like, wow. When he told me, I said, I thought there was the scripts they already did. He said, no, these are the ones we haven't even we haven't read. It just they're doing the good, doing the dumpster. They just like cold. I guess like send them to him. Like I guess like cold send them a script. No answer. Uh -huh. So he's okay. Just throw this shit in the dumpster. <laughs> like that's so that's so heartbreaking. I mean, that's not it's not heartbreaking. I mean, you think of, like, everybody in the world is trying to be a writer or make something, and then they just send it all to the studio, and yeah. they just take it, you know? Yeah. I mean, right. they say unsolicited, but they still send it. They still send it, right, right. And they think, like, oh, it's going to go to, like, a head of the studio. Like, no, an intern looks at it, and, like, eh, unsolicited. 
Toss right. it over here. Mm-hmm. Right. They, ain't, they don't have no kind of representation. In that. That's why agents exist. So they could, yeah. That's why they have agents. So you can be introduced. Yeah. That makes sense. That makes sense. So yeah, that's... But a, now, the world of social media, YouTube, everything else, is like, we could, you could surpass all that fucking bullshit. Right. If you're famous and you got the numbers, someone calls you, like, hey, do you want to do a project? I'm like, are you paying? They're like, yes. I'm like, let's do the project. <laughs> right, right. You're right. I'm pretty sure Amazon, yeah, because I, I even saw an interview, I think, Mr. Beast, uh, Jimmy was saying that they that they came to him. Amazon came to him about doing doing the uh, the Beast games. Right. And there are, like, people in Princeton thinking about, like, writing reality shows, you know, pitching to Amazon. And here comes a fucking YouTuber like, oh, no, I didn't think about it. They they, they just gave me a title. <laughs> right. They gave, gave me a bag of money. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, how did you get that? Oh, I just went on YouTube and tried to saw through a wooden table with a plastic spoon for 24 hours. I read the uh, dictionary from the back for 24 hours. I know. It's, uh, what's that? You went to Princeton? That's cool, man. I think Princeton's in the dictionary somewhere. I mean, what else did you do? Well, I said Jake Paul in a 24-hour stream. Like, what do you mean? <laughs> Just his name. Just Jake Paul, Jake Paul, Jake Paul for 24 hours. <laughs> and got a deal with Walmart. <laughs> right, right. Wouldn't it be great in your 24 hour stream or whatever from Uber? Uber spots that and, like, hey man, we want to do a partnership. I'm like, are you fucking serious? Right. You, you didn't see me pissing a bottle, right? <laughs> yeah, we love it. We love your dedication. I'm like, are you what? <laughs> oh shit. Oh boy. Oh shit! Hmm. Maybe I, yeah, I, maybe I'll start Monday. Yeah, but whatever, man. Just, uh, I think it's gonna be fascinating. I gotta try to, yeah. Just stay in the car. Don't fucking get out. Just drive, motherfuckers, all day long, all night. Right, but you have to tell them to get the reaction from them. <laughs> tell them, hey, I'm doing a twenty-four hour drive-a-thon, <laughs> Uber-thon. I haven't got out of the car yet, but I act like really concerned. Like, I I haven't got out of the car yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Well, when they see my kid, usually when they ask me, they ask me, why am I laughing? I just tell them I'm doing a, I'm doing a, a I'm doing an Uber challenge right now. I'm trying to see how long. Yeah, nice. Nice. Yeah. So I mean, if you if you know like if they're kind of cool maybe like fuck around with them you know like god damn it should eat that Korean barbecue before I got on stream <laughs> challenge is challenge it's gonna be a little gassy here you might want to let your windows down <laughs> <laughs> oh shit yeah yeah I think I, I think that's a good idea the Uber challenge it's fantastic yeah. See, Ryan, I knew you would, you would, you would have me work the ideals out. Yeah, man, you just uh, you just need another crazy motherfucker, you know? Right, right, right. <laughs> and then, like, show me. You don't need a dude to be like, "That's insane." You yeah. should just just do yeah, another a regular nine to five. Right. All right. Yeah. You just you just you just, you just, you just get a job at the post office. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man! Anyway, what you about to do? Uh, I'm probably gonna play video games, but tomorrow there's a puppy fest, and <laughs> on Monday there's the Mustafa premiere. It's like all, a bunch of uh, I think Beyonce and like a lot of famous black people. Where? The Chinese theater, Mustafa. Mus 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 oh, that the movie. That they've been working yeah. that shit for. They've been working. I thought that movie Ben came out. They were, they, they, they just releasing that shit. Yeah, this December, but the premiere is to Monday at the Chinese Theater at like five thirty. Oh, I think I'm gonna go and stream it. That'd be dope for my um stream, my stream thon thing. Right. right, right, and there's a puppy Christmas thing on Melrose, like a bunch of puppies, and they do a contest. I don't know. I have to look it up. I'll send it to you. That's gonna be so many damn views. People love puppies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then what else? 
What time is that going to be, Ryan? Tomorrow. I have to look it up. I, I just I, I, it, it popped out of my calendar to remind me. I have to look it up. I'll send you the information. Yeah, see, but yeah, uh, I, Monday is the Mustafa thing, the Chinese theater. Monday, okay, at five thirty. Yeah, I'll do that Monday. But the puppy thing would be dope too. I could just shoot that. People love puppies. Mm hmm. And you could cut that up in like a bunch of shorts. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Just video take the puppies all day and shit. That's hours. What? Just hours and hours of just puppies. People love fucking puppies. I know that, that's what Joe has gonna do. All right, I know what you're gonna do. You know how fucked up my brain when I, I brought out the dictionary? I just thought about shorts and like, what if I just read the dictionary for like 60 seconds? That's a good idea. Or you can do each word. Each word is a short. It'll be short. Mm. Like, you know, the word is, and it's just put the title of the word in, and just read it off, and then boom, do another one. Oh, like the daily word? That's a pretty good idea. You can do the, you know, the daily word, or just a word every hour. <laughs> Explosive. <laughs> it's a noun. <laughs> Ready to burst. This is... This is <laughs> can I use it in a sentence? Yeah, I can use it in a sentence. Charles, <laughs> after eating, Tony and Barbecue decided to go on an Uber challenge. After hour 18, he told his passenger, I'm ready to explode. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> Unfortunately, this is entertainment now. Your goal also like to do Emmy hours, but your other goal is you should have goals, right? Mm -hmm. Your goal is like to do as much hours as you possibly can, maybe twenty four hours if that's one of the goals. Mm -hmm. And the other goal is to not get out of the car. And then your third goal is to oh. make somebody get out of the car. <laughs> make somebody get out of the car. Say something crazy to them. Hey, you know what? Right. I, I just realized something too, though, Ryan. I just realized something. I can't do no more than 12 hours. Oh, then 12 hours then. Because Uber kicks you out. Uber kicks you off the platform after you, after you, after, by law, they're not supposed to let you drive that long. Right, I'm saying like, okay, here's the thing, right? My brain is like, do you have, do you have um, the other one? Oh, live, I don't have live. Yeah, Can you just switch it. off when you're after 12 to go to Lyft? I don't have Lyft, though. The kind of, yeah, I, I don't have a Lyft. I think, I think they might have blocked me. I don't know. I, I got to see if I still got I signed up for Lyft from years ago. I got to see if I still got that account. Okay, so after 12, I think I read this before. You have to take an hour break, right? No, you have to take, I think they they, they let you back on after, I think after like six hours, they let you back on. Oh, uh, that's, that's lame. Yeah. They want you to get some because you can't you can't people been because people used to, they used to just let you just drive all night but I guess people was doing it and was falling asleep and <laughs> killing people and shit. Okay, <laughs> okay. I, I had a crazy idea, but like let's 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 not do that. Yeah. I'm not even gonna say it because it's too insane. Okay, let's do it to 12 hours first. But when you get a chance to reactivate the the lift one, so you could do 12 hours back to back. Yeah. Yeah, I gotta see. Yeah, but gotta... for right now, let's do the twelve hours. Yeah, see what happens. <laughs> let's see how it's, 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 let's see how it works out. See, it's it's good to bounce around ideas. Yeah, especially if you're bouncing with a crazy motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, what you about to do, Ryan? You about to you about to go? What you about to do? You about to go eat? I don't want to take a shit now. All this shit talking is making me have an explosive diarrhea in my butt. That's good. You've been eating a lot of fiber. That's good. That's good. At our age, we got to eat a lot of fiber. I was going to say. Oh, uh, I had like another idea to like meet up with everyone. Maybe in an aquarium. Yeah, let me know so I can stream it. Yeah, I was thinking about an aquarium, like me kind of drunk. Yeah, and I'll take some edibles. <laughs> Oh my god, yeah. The last time I had an edible one in an aquarium, I saw like the, the bottle nosed dolphin and I swear to god he was talking to me and Angela's like, dude, 
dude, stop talking to the dolphin. <laughs> I'm like, Angela, can you hear him? He wants to be free. <laughs> no, I don't know. Do I, I, he's like, look I at the, and he's like, look at that, that hole. Do you think I can? No. I don't know. <laughs> dude, I want to put the dolphin in the hole. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you talk, too. That's how you think it's Oh, boy. Anyway. All right. All right. Yeah, yeah. So let me know about the puppy thing. Yeah, I'll uh, do it right now. All right, then. Peace. Later. We're going to get some gas. What time? It's late. It's like 8 o'clock. Shit. I'm fucking around. Get back out here in these streets. I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to do that. I rather I rather just do like the brokathon because that all ties in together. You know what I'm saying? What y'all think? Shot shot. Ryan got he he says I, I should do the ooh, burping. He says he says I should do like the Uber the Uber challenge. Well, I think I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do the brokathon. I mean, I, <clears throat> I could do the Uber challenge tomorrow. Give it like a test run. The Uber challenge. How long can I do Uber? Yeah, but then, but but then I think I, I think I want to, I think I want to do, um, I want to do, um, I do want to do the brokerthon though. I seriously think, I, I seriously think I want to do the brokerthon. Yeah, that's a girl or a dude. I don't know what you can't tell in LA. You know, you just, you just never know. Anyway, man, well, y'all, y'all think I should, I should do the brokerthon? Well, you know what? I'm gonna do the Uber challenge, and then I'm gonna do the brokerthon. Yeah, I'm gonna do the Uber challenge tomorrow, and then I'll start prepping for the bro the brokathon. Yeah, that's that's the that's 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 what I'm gonna do. 